Hello. Hi. Today we are in Auckland, New Zealand. Six weeks at sea. We finally arrived. Here are the tour details from the PO site. Please feel free to pause the video if you want to read through them slower. So we had a nice quick and easy disembarkation and our coach was literally waiting right outside as we got off the ship. Our driver took us on a scenic guided route out to the Michael Savage Memorial having originally gone through town to point out some of the city highlights on our way there. We were then taken to the museum for the Maori performance. Unfortunately, we weren't able to record it, but we've put some stills in. I have a few announcements before we get into our performance. Firstly, beginning with your tickets. Now, if you look at your ticket, it should say Maori cultural performance on it. Now, I'm sorry, but if you do not have these tickets, you will not be able to enter into our We were then driven through a really pretty area known as Parnell and we decided to go back there and get some lunch. This was the cheapest Uber I think I've ever had. From the dockside to Parnell it was only four UK pounds. After lunch we went to this lovely chocolatiers in Parnell which had some amazing treats. After lunch we headed back into town and took a trip up the Sky Tower. We booked these tickets online as they were a fair bit cheaper. There were amazing views over the city. Something you can do if you're brave enough is a free full experience from the top of the tower. Personally, I think you'd have to be crazy to do this, but there seem to be lots of willing participants. After looking around, we then took a glass bottom lift back down to the ground. The day went way too quickly and we finally had a beautiful sail away from Auckland. The description says that this includes about an hour of walking. The reality, we had 15 minutes off of the bus at the memorial. We were then taken to the museum for the Maori performance, which was seated, and we weren't given time to actually look around the museum. Personally, because we had such a long day in Auckland, I feel a hop on hop off bus would be a better option if you want to have a really good look around. Therefore, we're given this one a seven out of 10. If you enjoyed this and would like to continue following us on our travels, please consider subscribing to our channel. And give us a like, if you have any questions or comments, please leave them below.